We've mentioned Knox County Schools going all virtual tomorrow because of the weather. Parents, however, that split on the decision. WAT6 on your side reporter Kirsty Crawford hears from both sides of the snow day debate. I'm happy about it. Crystal Taylor will have three kids learning online. Two of them are already virtual, which is why the entire district going online isn't so bad for her household. I'm glad we're going virtual. It means I don't have to get up and get him out for school in the morning, and I don't have to worry about it being icy. She says the virtual day will be like a double whammy, safe from ice and COVID-19. With how high the numbers are right now anyway with COVID, it works out better. We're going to have a three-day weekend. Hopefully, infection rates will go down. However, other parents, like Jennifer Larson, wishes KCS made it a snow day. I feel like they should have done a two-hour delay or canceled school. Let the kids have fun. Knox County Schools doesn't have any more snow days. District officials say they use them all, delaying the start of the school year by two weeks. Larson says that shouldn't take away from actual bad weather days. They had all summer to get ready for school. They really let the kids down and did not do enough. Larson will also have three kids at home for the virtual snow day. She doesn't plan to make them be in class for the unusual occasion. This is a big deal because usually I don't let them skip school. But if we have a decent amount of snow, we're going to take a break after everything that's happened in the country over the last couple of days and just with the pandemic and everything, they deserve to have kid fun. There is one thing that several parents agree on, including Larson and Taylor. They are grateful the teachers are understanding and that classes are asynchronous. Asynchronous one, it's where they are not on the computer the whole entire time. That's plenty of time for my children to get their work in, but we will be out playing in the snow. We are going to go sledding and have fun. Kirsty Crawford, WATE6, on your side. All right, Kirsty, thank you. Remember, Knox County Schools is going virtual tomorrow because of the weather. That said, we still have a coronavirus update for the school system we want to pass along to you. Knox County Schools reporting the total number of Knox County students and staff in quarantine because of COVID-19 has nearly doubled since January 4th.